all right guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be uh you know showing us uh doing a demonstration on how to uh activate or uh you know connect uh google authenticator to our bybit account i am doing this based on uh you know popular demand so and before we start if this is your first time on my channel kindly hit on that like button as well as you know give me a subscription and also hit on that notification bell with this you'll be able to uh, you know see my videos as soon as i release them okay very quickly the very first thing you will need to do is to go to play store or your app store depending on uh, which uh you know uh operating system your phone is using either you are using iphone or you are using uh you know the an android phone you just go and you for this i am using uh you know an android phone for this so you just locate your play store you go to play store or you go to your app store then you uh you know download the google authenticator app now this is the google authenticator app i'll be using you can see this with uh you can see authenticator look at my screen it's uh this one with a logo like a star with blue yellow green and red uh you know color so i'll just click on it this google authenticator so this is the google authenticator so very quickly i will head over to my bybit account now why you need to install uh connect your google authenticator with your bybit account is because uh for you to be able to perform any transactions either uh to withdraw or to deposit you will need uh it's required by uh, Bybit that you, you know, you enable uh, Google Authenticator. So very quickly, I will head over to Assets. Asset is at the bottom, uh, bottom left, bottom right corner of the Bybit app. So you can see it here. I'll just click on Assets. Now you can see here I have uh, Deposit, Withdraw, Transfer, Convert, Giveaway easy buy so i'll just click on withdraw here at the middle now you can see here it says add email linked so i already added email to this account then the next it says set up google to fa authentication you can see it says not set so what i'll just have to do here is to click on what is to click on this set up now so i'll just click on this uh set up now i'll just click on this set up now i'll click on set up now all right it opens you can see this page it says um it says security verification send the verification code to this email address so what i will just have to do is i will go to my email address I'll go to my email address to receive to copy this code that are, that has just been sent to my email. So I will locate my email. I will locate my email here. I'll locate my email. Now you can see by bits this email just came. I'll click on it. Then this is the code I will just uh, copy. I'll copy this code. Then add over to Bybit. Add over to Bybit. Then paste. After I paste this code, I will just click on confirm. Now you can see it said, "Please install Google Authenticator app on your phone." Now because I already have a Google Authenticator app installed on my phone. Do not forget, I said the very first thing you need to do is to go to Play Store or your App Store to install Google Authenticator app. Now, I will just click on Continue since I already have the app installed on my phone. I will click on Continue. Then you can see it gives us this code and it says uh, this key. It says copy key and add to 
Google Authenticator. So you copy this key. You copy this key. You can see this key is already copied. Now this is the key you take to Google Authenticator. Now I'll go back to my Google Authenticator. I'll go back to my Google Authenticator. See here it says add code, add a code. Then you click on this add a code. Now we see two options here. The first option it says scan a QR code. Why the second option it says enter a setup key now because we have a key we are using a setup key so you click on the second option option which says what enter a setup key now the and now the next uh, page it says enter account details now account name do not forget you might be adding different uh accounts to this uh to this Google Authenticator other than Bybit. Since this is for Bybit, you just come here, enter Bybit, you click, by, you enter Bybit, so that you will be able to know that this uh, account is for Bybit. Then the next thing here, it says your key. Now that key we just copied from uh, Bybit. You now paste the key here, paste. Then the next thing it says type of key. Now the type of key you'll be using for this uh you know for this video is time based. Now you can click on this arrow, you can see it has another one which is counter based, but you will be using the time based. Now the next thing you need to do is to just click on this ad. Now immediately you click on this, you can see we have buy bits, and you can see this code 44104 theory. Now look at this blue uh this circle, this blue team moving, going getting smaller so once this these things finish it's a timer a new code comes you can see now we have a new code now it starts uh, counting again it starts rolling again so immediately this finishes you will see another code we call. this is 918356 now since we've set this up now let's go back to our bybits account now this is our buy bit it says since we've copied this and entered it on our authenticator you click on next now it says what google authenticator get code now this step is for you to enter the code from what from your google authenticator so we'll go back to our google authenticator you can see we you can see we have another code now you need to be very fast when entering this code because once this timer finishes a new code come if you are late when this timer finishes that code will expire it will not work again so let's just wait for this to finish to get a new code all right it's almost done it's almost finished now it's finished we have 701040 701040 seven 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 zero one zero four zero you need to be very fast now it says google authenticator set up successfully now you can see we have successfully set up our google authenticator all right uh thank you very much this is how to set up a uh, google authenticator on your bybit account you can see let's go back to our home go back to our home and go back to assets click on withdraw again now, if you click on withdraw this time, you can see uh, it did not give us the first information it gave us to set up our Google Authenticator. So whenever you want to make withdraw or whenever you want to send out crypto, it will be required for you to enter a code from this Google Authenticator. All right. Thank you very much. Uh, have a lovely day. Bye bye.